Hello, Debbie Nicholson speaking, and today my topic is about service and being willing to serve. Now, um, when I talked about talk about service, I'm thinking, are you? Well, the other day I talked to you about being a mix of kindness and you know, and saying thank you to all for the great things that happened for you, being great and grateful. And this all comes into um, the service part as as well. Um, there's a story told of a young man who approached an employer for a job and there were no vacancies at the time and he was only young, he was 16 and he just wanted a little part-time job to help him through his schoolwork, uh, schooling days and also to help him to raise money for his future college years. Anyway, I approached this employer and he got on, he was on the phone and said to him, look, you don't know me at all, um, but I know that I've got something really special that I can do for you and I would like to uh, lay out a plan for you when you've got time. I would like to um, tell you what it is that I can do for you in your business and when you've got time, could you give me some time that I can come and see you and talk to you? Anyway, um, the employer seemed quite impressed with this person and so he said, well, yes, um, you know, come along and see me at a certain time. And so he brought him in and when the young man arrived, he was all dressed up, he looked very dapper, he was clean and tidy, he had been had shaven, he had a very nice clothes on, he um, had a good look in his eye, he shook the employer, the employer's hand and said, look, it was very polite, his manners were impeccable. And he um, sat after he was asked to sit and thanked, was thanking the person, the employer, for um, having him there. And he called him sir. Every time he talked to him, he said, yes, sir, yes, sir. So he was using the right kind of words to make an employer feel impressed with him. And he said that he told the employer that um, his mother had shopped at this particular grocery store for many years and she just was so delighted in what she saw and the service etc and he felt that he had the talent and the abilities that could help him enhance his business so the man said well you know what what is it that you can do for me so he proceeded to tell him a little plan that he had and he was willing to come in for one whole week and a Saturday afternoon for free just offer services so that the employer could see how he worked. Now the employer was so impressed, he said, look, take off your jacket. Have you got time now? He said, yes. He said, look, take off your jacket and let's go out there. So he took him out to one of the shelves and he said, what could you do here? And he, the boy told him all about what he could do to improve the look of that, the shelf and etc. why he thought that um, he could improve it because you know he'd had a good talk to his mother and his mother had taken him around the stores and told him that she likes to see things at a certain level because that's what attracts her eye. She likes to see things in certain amounts, she likes to see particular products somewhere and so, so forth and so forth. And he'd been educated by his mother in the shopping game and so this boy was very, very educated in how customers, who are happy customers, like to see the layout of a an aisle. And so he proceeded to sort out the shelf that he was assigned to, to, to um, and the employer took him on instantly. And he didn't even have to watch him after a couple of hours. He was just so impressed in his attitude, he was so impressed in his willingness to serve, he was willing to give his time for free. Anyway, um, I think he did probably give a few, a couple of days for free, but the employer could see a great um, potential in him and took him on as part of his staff. And that young man was with him for many, many years through all of his education years, and he saw him grow to be a, a great director of a company, of a different company altogether in his later life. So um, your willingness to serve, are you prepared put yourself out in order to get your job, the job that you want. Um, are you, are you, do you know enough about the work that you want to do? Um, have you educated yourself as to what you want, what it is that will make it better for another person coming along? So these are the things you need to be thinking about. And, and your willingness to serve is always picked up by an employer. They don't, they're not really interested in those people who say, well, what time do we get out of here? And off they go 
as soon as the bell rings and they think, oh, off I'll go, and they don't even do anything extra afterwards. You know, it's the people who do a little bit extra, give them themselves, get there early, leave a little bit late, and they are rewarded in the end because someone always is watching them. So watch out for your willingness to serve. Be, be, be sincere in your um, service abilities. And I know that the world will open up for you. Okay, so I will end this one now and I'll talk to you again tomorrow. Bye-bye.